Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's art exhibition. In this collection, we will be exploring the remarkable works of the artist Alfred Sisley. Sisley, born in 1839, led a life that was deeply connected to nature, particularly to the rivers and landscapes of France. Throughout his career, Sisley found inspiration in the beauty of the countryside, and his experiences in different locations greatly influenced his artwork. Take, for example, the edges of lowing in St. Mam and mourning at St. Mam, both created in 1884. These paintings depict the serene surroundings of the village, showcasing Sisley's ability to capture the peacefulness and tranquility of his surroundings. In Watermill near Moet from 1883, Sisley showcases his fascination with the power and beauty of water. The painting transports us to a picturesque scene where the watermill stands tall, forever frozen in time. Similarly, in The Beggar from the same year, we see Sisley's keen eye for capturing the unique textures and colors of the riverbank. Moving to the Road of Moet from 1882, we witness Sisley's mastery at portraying the play of light and shadow. The painting transports us to a moment in time when the sunlight gently illuminates the road, inviting us to walk alongside it. And in The Chestnut in St. Mam also from 1883, we see Sisley's ability to infuse nature with a sense of life, as the chestnut tree stands majestically, its leaves shimmering in the breeze. One cannot discuss Sisley's work without mentioning his skillful portrayal of trees and their reflections in water. Saint Mamas from 1883 and Poplars on a River Bank from 1882 are prime examples of this. The delicate brushstrokes capture the ethereal beauty of these natural elements, transporting us to a world where time stands still. As we delve further into Sisley's collection, we encounter banks of the lowing autumn effect from 1883. In this painting, Sisley's use of warm colors and his ability to convey the changing seasons evoke a sense of nostalgia and tranquility. Finally, we come across a path to the Sablins from 1883. This painting offers a glimpse into Sisley's fascination with pathways, leading the viewer on a journey through the mesmerizing French countryside. Alfred Sisley's art takes us on a visual voyage through his personal experiences and observations of nature. With each stroke of his brush, he invites us to pause, reflect, and appreciate the beauty that surrounds us. Thank you for joining us on this artistic journey. Enjoy the exhibition.